Biomedical Research Centre. This is an infrastructure grant. It's held jointly by Imperial College London and Imperial College Healthcare NHS Trust. And it provides us with funding for laboratories and facilities and, and people to conduct clinical and translational research across Northwest London. The BRC is, is, is really about pulling through the discoveries, the basic science discoveries into the clinic. You have the expertise of the clinicians pulling across the, uh, the technology as well as the technological drive from the discovery scientists in the college. My job is to accelerate how quickly that science translates into large-scale clinical trials or even delivery as new technology uh, in the wards or in outpatients or even in primary care. The funding has supported us in our roles. It's paid for our, our jobs, essentially. And it's also paid for um, you know, things like computers to mobiles, blood taking equipment when we need it, all the things that we need in order to deliver our role. I support the training and the research uh, of lots of healthcare professionals. And I also do my own research as well as being a physiotherapist in outpatients within the, the therapies department of the hospital. The way that all our healthcare professionals can get involved in research is really exciting because it ranges from early stage in a research process, so the support for people to do masters in research through to postdoctoral, so financial support along the whole track of developing healthcare professionals uh, as researchers. And part of that is in collaboration between the Biomedical Research Centre and Imperial Health Charity. The Biomedical Research Centre has 14 themes, those are generally their clinical areas, and, and four what we call threads or areas of focus. So those 14 themes, uh, those, those medical areas are defined in two ways. One is by the needs of the, po of the local community and also by the expertise by our researchers in the college and in the trust. Those four aims or threads those are early diagnosis, precision medicine, convergence science, uh, and, and digital health. But we're also working far more with our community. Our patient partners uh, are critical to the success of this. They've helped us to define our objectives. They will also be helping us to deliver the research. I think it's important that the public be involved in the research not only important but essential because the researcher will have uh, their own view of what is important but only us as patients and as public know what we are living every day, what is needed in a daily life. They are the one that knows what is possible but we can tell them what we need. Living in North West London I think it's important for me to bring awareness of the need of our community the diversity, people from different backgrounds, and that's why people need to be involved in research. I think the key word here is equity, and that's really important amongst the diverse healthcare professionals. So we need to make sure that we're very supportive of people who are not as embedded in research, as well as uh, to people who are much more, and professions that are much more embedded within research. One of the privileges of being BRC director is, is, is working with some really impressive people, uh, researchers, uh, research delivery staff, the clinical staff and of course the patients. And I, I take huge pride when this all comes together and you see uh, major changes happening in terms of you know, new treatments, new diagnoses, better management of patients. When you're doing research, what we're looking for is to uh, change not just one patient's outcome, but the outcome of hundreds or thousands of patients in our community or worldwide.